thank you very much, and I have uh, asked, and you have agreed to perhaps to ask me some questions here before I leave you, because, uh, because I know that you have, I know that I know that you have a couple things on your mind. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am, right back there, and I, I think we've got a microphone coming so that, would you bring, there we are. Hello, Senator Pine. The recent flooding in the Midwest, FEMA has come in, and I am a victim of, of flooding, and I want to know in your uh, cabinet, how do you plan on revamping FEMA? Because there's a lot of things that are not told to the victims. We are not being ass assessed and assisted in the way that we should be. And I would like to know your thoughts and ideas for addressing FEMA. Thank you. My thoughts are that the tragedy and injustice of New Orleans can never happen again. It was an abject failure of government, and there's no excuse for it. When babies are dehydrated and senior citizens are dying, there is no excuse for that failure in America and can never be repeated and it will remain a national disgrace until the American people have the confidence that it will never happen again. Now, I think there's a number of things that be done, need to be done. First, you appoint and ask the most qualified people in America to serve, not political appointees. The first, the second thing, the second thing that you do, in my view, is that we go to some of the major and, and large and small businesses in America that know how to deliver goods and services. You know that whether well, it was a truck full of water that ended up, uh, bottles of water that ended up in Maine? Do you think that Walmart or Home Depot or any of those people would have not kept track of everything? I think we need to have a combination of government and, and business so that they who have these, these, these lines of distribution and are able to deliver the goods and services as necessary. And I think, frankly, we need to do maybe some drills. You know what I mean? How does the federal government react to the next hurricane? I pray God it's not going to happen, but the, the, the uh, weatherman tells me a, a little different. But the, but, but the point is, the point is that we have to be prepared and we have to understand that the attacks on America by natural calamities in many respects are as bad or worse in its ultimate effects than the attacks by terrorists from outside this country or from inside this country. So I want to assure you of my commitment from a top to bottom reorganization and review. And there, finally, there's so many things that need to be done, we could spend a whole speech on it. But the other failure, as you know, was a lack, total lack of cooperation between federal, state, and local authorities. There has got to be better cooperation and work together. Thank you for your question. Yes. I, sir, I'd, I'd like to recognize this person here right there, and, and I think they have...